as we continue to walk through Proverbs. Verse by verse, we read many bite-sized truths that are timeless and applicable to life. Today, we're in Proverbs chapter 17. And while we could discuss each of these verses at length, I'd like to highlight the last two. Verse 27 says, a truly wise person uses few words. A person with understanding is even tempered. Even fools are thought wise when they keep silent. With their mouth shut, they seem intelligent. Friends, we live in a time and culture where words have become cheap. With social media, text messaging, and verbal platforms at our fingertips, we can communicate with one another around the clock, 24 seven. We have to turn our devices off or on do not disturb in order to stop the words from flooding into our minds from every direction. If you've ever known a quiet person or someone who uses few words, you'll notice that when they do speak, we listen. Our words have great impact. With our words, we can encourage, bless, we can build one another up. But with our words, we can also tear down embitter, and even destroy. Spoken words have power. When God spoke, the world was created. When our Lord Jesus spoke during his earthly ministry, people were completely healed, sins were forgiven, storms were calmed, and even the dead were raised to new life. The words of his teaching completely changed the course of history. As a follower of Jesus, be reminded today that his power now lives in you. This is not only an absolute miracle, but also a great responsibility on our part. So use your words wisely today in a way that will be pleasing to God. In the book of James, chapter one, verse 19 through 21, he says, understand this, my dear brothers and sisters, you must all be quick to listen, slow to speak and slow to get angry. Human anger does not produce the righteousness God desires. Remember today, your words have impact. Use them wisely. Take time to listen to others. And if you choose to speak, do it carefully to bring life and light to the hearers in your world today.